everybody and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is about overnight oats. Um, overnight oats are one of my favorite go-to meal prep items because I can fix them on Sunday night and I can make enough for my husband and I to have one each day of the week. So they're naturally gluten-free if you buy the gluten-free oats. You can make them dairy-free. In this case, I'm using almond milk. I hope you enjoy this video and give this recipe a try. Today I'm going to share with you three of my favorite flavor combinations. I'm going to start by putting a half a cup of oats into each one of my jars. Each one of these recipes is going to start with the same base and that's just half a cup of oats, one cup of unsweetened almond milk, a teaspoon of vanilla, and a pinch of salt. To make the brown sugar and cinnamon flavor, I'm just going to add the one cup of unsweetened almond milk to my half cup of oats, a teaspoon of vanilla, a pinch of salt, I'm going to use the brown sugar stevia and I'm adding one teaspoon of that. Next, add a dash of cinnamon and half of a sliced banana. You can leave the banana out if you want to. I chose to use it because I needed to use it anyway, but also when you add fruit to your overnight oats, it kind of bulks it up. Then I add one scoop of my favorite vanilla protein powder and give it a good shake. This blueberry coconut flavor is probably my all time favorite. I love the sweetness from the blueberries, but I also love the chewiness of the coconut. As you can see, I'm starting out the exact same way with the almond milk, vanilla, and the pinch of salt. Next, I'm throwing in two teaspoons of regular stevia, my blueberries, a scoop of vanilla protein powder, and a little handful of coconut. The third flavor that I want to share with you today is banana nut, and it tastes just like banana nut bread. You just want to start the same way with the half cup oats, one cup of unsweetened almond milk, a teaspoon of vanilla, and a pinch of salt. Then I add in the other half of my banana, and two teaspoons of your sweetener of choice, in this case I use the stevia, one scoop of your favorite vanilla protein powder, and then I chopped up just a couple tablespoons of walnuts. After you've assembled all of your overnight oats, just store them in the refrigerator until you're ready to enjoy them. I found that they last for several days in the refrigerator. So this makes them the perfect meal prep item and makes life easier on those busy mornings. I hope this video brought you some new meal inspiration. If you don't mind, please click that subscribe button. Thank you so much for stopping by my channel today.